We are in the Lucy Peters room at Bacon College. This is the first semester of the voice class. And I have three people. I think they're doing very well and I'm enjoying it. I hope to teach a song in German, French, uh, Italian, the Cherokee, and just familiarize uh, each student with the technique of singing. It's just the very beginning. You're just scratching the surface in a voice class like this. Bacon was very famous for its music in years past. They have now praise and worship choir. They have a gospel choir already. And in the old days, in the, gosh, 30s, 40s, 50s, they had a choir that was even on Ed Sullivan's show. The choir toured the United States and I, I would love to see that happen again. I've always been interested in music. I sing at the pra on the praise team here, and I met Barbara when I worked at a church here in town and took some lessons from her last spring and found out that she was teaching this class here, so I decided to enroll. I grew up in choirs, so it's the same as growing up in choirs, but it's more personal because there's not as many people the reason I wanted to join this class is because I want to uh, uh, contribute to the choir at my church. And uh, I have some issues with singing, and uh, Barbara works, Barbara McAllister is an excellent teacher, and she can uh, get me further down the road than I could stumbling on my own. She says I'm doing better now. Uh, I, I believe that uh, I'm much more aware of what I'm supposed to be doing, and I've picked up a couple of good clues like uh, projecting that my voice does better when I push the air through my vocal cords than when I don't. And we, we've reviewed uh, octaves, and we do voice lessons for warm-ups and uh, uh, voice exercises, and I think that's terrific. I mean, it's just exactly what I needed, and I needed some coaching, and I probably continue to need coaching for a long time.